It's important to develop yourself, to try to, to learn different, uh, different things. It's important always is about to, to manage people when you are coach, uh, not only the player, if not your staff, uh, and the people that work uh, of, uh, on the club. It's a natural quality that you need to, to have. Leadership needs to be uh, very clear, very very human. It's not only because you are the, the manager or the coach or the head coach, you are a leader. I think that you need to, to show that you are a very a human leader. Teaching and coaching is, is completely different. Some it will fall naturally for and to, but, um, but there's lots of elements of teaching uh, and coaching young people and, and players which, uh, which requires knowledge and for you to gain that knowledge, you, uh, you need to go out, you need to research, you need to find it. And, uh, and if you're going to be the very best that you can be, then it's very important that you, um, that you can enrol on courses. Coach education is, is vitally important because of the way that the game has changed. If I, and if I looked at my pathway, you know, I was a coach at Tottenham Hotspur for 14 and a half years before uh, I went into management. Um, for me, it was the ideal pathway, and and if I looked at my education, coach education along that pathway, probably more so in the latter part um, of that, where I managed to get a diploma in uh, in management, um, and I think in my period of time, there is no doubt that there's, there has been more available to coaches, certainly more now than in the early part of my uh, coaching career. I think for my education in, in terms of coaching is really, really important, I think. Um, I think it upskills you in the knowledge of the game. I think it allows you to disseminate all that information appropriately to the age group of players you're working with. Um, and that's really important and to understand how the game develops and how it moves forward. So it keeps you abreast of of, of current affairs, if you like, in football. The game changes and changes all the time. And part of the education process helps you adapt to those changes when you're, you're, you're coaching kids, adults, whoever it may be. So for me, um, alongside experience, getting those formal qualifications are really important. The experience is the most important thing. You know, I would say if they can get out and get around and watch more see, watch more senior uh, coaches and managers work um, and if they can get involved in coaching it's you know actually being hands-on is the best way to learn there's nothing like theory you can read all the books you want but actually getting out there and doing it yourself and being in, around footballers and uh, and doing the, the coaching and that is without doubt the best experience they can have <laughs>